Weight is one of the most important metrics when talking about aircraft, but did you know there isn't just one definition of it? I'm an aerospace engineer and in aviation, weight has precise definitions used for loading, performance, and structural limits calculations. Depending on the authority or manufacturer, the terms may vary, but the usual terms go like this. We start with the empty weight, the aircraft itself, including the airframe engines and systems. Add everything required to operate it aside from fuel, like the crew, their bags, and emergency equipment, and you get the operating empty weight. Next, add the payload. The revenue generating load like the passengers, their baggage, or cargo, and you get the zero fuel weight, which is simply the aircraft's total weight without usable fuel on board. Adding the usable fuel for the mission, including reserves and the fuel needed to taxi, gives you the ramp weight. After burning taxi fuel and lining up on the runway, the airplane is at its takeoff weight. As the flight progresses, fuel burns off, and the heaviest weight the manufacturer has certified for landing is called the maximum landing weight. And at any point in that whole shebang, the total weight of the airplane is simply called the gross weight.